So on a right turn, you want to signal to the right. I'm about a meter, three feet away from the curb. I'm going to stop behind the line here. And I took a quick look at the curb, right, so that I wouldn't lose track of it. There's a little bit of snow around the corner, but normally what I want to do is I want to track around the corner uh, and follow the curb, okay? So I'm looking both ways. It looks good. Oh, actually, there's a car coming now, so I'm going to wait for a second. It's important to steer in relation to the speed of the car. So I'm going to be going fairly slow around the corner. So just using my hand over hand. Now I'm looking down the road at this point and I'm just correcting the car and a little bit of gas. So let's try that again. So I'm signaling to the right. Okay, I'm gonna follow this curb. And around the corner I go. Okay. So let's try a left turn. So on a left turn, the difficulty is or the mistake that most people make is they start turning too soon. So as I approach here, I'm gonna signal left. I'm gonna check my mirror. I'm gonna move a little bit closer to the center of the road and I'm braking. I'm still looking ahead to make sure that I'm straight. Here I'm gonna stop just at the edge of the road because there is no stop line. And that's exactly where I'm gonna to start to turn is right at the edge of the road because there's only two lanes here. Okay, again, I'm gonna use my hand over hand starting at nine and three. So there's hand over hand. Halfway through, my eyes shoot down the road. I'm looking down the road, and I'm going to correct hand over hand, a little bit of gas, and off I go. Okay, so the big mistakes that people make on left turns, they turn too soon. They cut up, end up cutting across the uh, oncoming traffic lane. And on a right turn, they lose track of where that curb is, which is a little bit harder uh, when there is snow covering the curb. I'll admit that. So let's try this uh, two more times. So we're going to make a left up here. So again, I'm signaling to the left. Okay, I'm moving a little bit closer to the center of the road. I'm braking. I'm gonna start my turn where that new road begins here. So right about now, right? Using my hand over hand, looking down the new road, right? I straighten the car up and off I go, okay? Once you've been driving for a while, you may start to realize that these front wheels sort of wanna straighten themselves out that's called slide recovery. It's acceptable on a road test. We never want to 100% rely on slide recovery because sometimes it'll fool us. I'm going to make a right turn up here. So again, I just checked out the curb, making sure the intersection's safe. I'm just following the curb. When I come out, I should be roughly about a meter away from the curb, which I am. Okay. Now this corner up here doesn't require a signal light because it's just the same street, it just happens to go around. Okay, so those are the tips I can give you for turning right and left. A right turn, check out where that curb is, don't stare at it, just a quick look at the curb. And uh, make sure that you um, follow that curb around, right, and your hand speed matches the speed of the car. And on a left turn, don't turn too soon, make sure that you're lined up with that, uh, with the new road. Okay, I'm John from Truby Cars. Drive safe.